definitely tell we're in the Oscar movie season. Does this movie have some great performances? Heck yeah, but whoo, is it a long, slow burn. Rose, I got something to tell you. I don't know how to tell you this. Why, Tori? Why? You ought to know it's time. I don't want to know, damn it! What you ever give me? Your feet, them bones, that pumping heart. You ain't never done nothing but hold me back, afraid I was gonna be better than you. Everything that boy do, he do for you. It's not easy for me to admit that I've been standing in the same place for 18 years. Well, I've been standing with you. I got a life too. Don't you think I had dreams and hopes? What about my life? What about me? You will do. Some people build fences to keep people out, and other people build fences to keep people in. Fences. This is the Denzel Washington directed and starring movie based on a popular play and book. And uh, I didn't know this, but this is Denzel Washington's third directed movie, which is pretty crazy. It also stars Viola Davis, um, a bunch of other people, but their main two are Viola Davis and mainly Denzel Washington. This is a movie built around dialogue and performances. It is basically a two and a half hour movie of pure dialogue. So if that seems like something you're interested in, then you're going to love this. But if not, don't go watch this because it's a slow burner for sure. Um, Denzel gives probably the best performance I've ever seen him give in this movie. It is spectacular. Um, he starts off as kind of just this every kind of every man kind of guy. But as the movie goes along, you can see he has some serious flaws. And uh, by the end of the movie, you really do not like this character at all. Um, but Denzel does a fantastic job. Viola Davis is plays his wife, and she is fantastic too. She has to make very hard decisions that if it were me, there's no way I'd be able to do what she does in this movie. It gets very depressing at times, um, but you know, it does show a form of realism that will probably hit home with some people. Um, Denzel is, like I said, a flawed character. He has his demons and he tends to take it out on uh, his uh, kids a lot. Uh, he has a son who wants to play football and uh, he doesn't want him to play football. He wants him to uh, get a job and uh, he takes a lot out of his anger and frustration with life out on this kid. Like I said, the performances are fantastic in this. If you're looking for a great performance from Denzel, this is the movie to see. But it is just, like I said, two and a half hours, straight dialogue, um, not a whole lot going on. He kind of has this friend in the movie, too, that kind of brings a little humor. There are some funny moments in the movie, but they are sprinkled thinly throughout here. It's a pretty serious movie. So while I enjoyed it, this is definitely not a movie that I would watch again. Uh, it doesn't have that repeat quality to it for me, but uh, I did enjoy it. It has fantastic performances, so I'm going to give Fences a 4 out of 5. If you like this video, click that like button. Comment below if you want to talk to me about anything. Uh, click the Rainy Cage button to subscribe and keep up to date with all my videos. And I'll leave you with a few of my most recent videos and some of these sweet, sweet dance moves. This is Rainy Cage. Peace out.